Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad Education and welcome to the What's the Output video series on C programming language. Here we're going to give you a C program and we're going to ask you guys to guess the output of the program and then we're going to explain the output. So all you need to do is pause this movie and take a look at the source code which is here in the editor and then guess the output of the program and once you have an answer, just click on the play button. I'm going to run this program and explain the output. Alright, now I believe that you guys have an answer for this program. We're going to build and run this. So I'm going to do build and run. And the answer for this program is going to be the character H. Alright, now why the heck we're going to get the answer or you know the output as H. Here in this program we have used this character pointer str. And then we have stored the address of the first character of this string hello in this character pointer str. So if I have to draw an image of it then it's going to look something like this. So here hello will be stored in some memory locations and let's assume that the starting address of this string hello will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 which is nothing but this character h will be stored in the memory location 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So here in our program what we are doing is by writing str equal to hello we are storing the address of this character h in this character pointer str. So this str is gonna point to the first character of this string hello. Alright then what we are doing is inside this printf function we have written star and star str. So here this star is called as the dereference operator or the value at operator and the and is called as the reference operator or the address of operator. So this star operator or you know the value at operator is used to get the value stored in some memory locations and the and operator is used with variables to get the memory location where they are stored. So here in our program we have written star and star str. So what happens is first star str will be executed. So the value stored at the memory location which is specified in the pointer str. So the value stored in the memory location 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that is nothing but this character h. You know we're gonna get the h as the output when we do star str and then what we have done is we have done and star str so now star str is gonna give the character h and address of this character h is gonna be this 1 2 3 4 5 so and star str is gonna give 1 2 3 4 5 which is nothing but the address where the character h is stored and then we are doing star and star str. Now all of you know that the and star str is gonna give 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And now the star 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 which is nothing but the value at the memory location 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is gonna point to the character h. Since we are using the percentage %c format specifier here, it's gonna print out only one character and that's why you know it's gonna give us h as the output. So this is it guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Check out my YouTube channel Learning Lad for more tutorials and I'll see you in the next tutorial.